So were you ever going to tell me? Yeah, of course. Been looking forward to this day for ages. What do you think? Because I'd look like the good guy for once, wouldn't I? <laughs> I would have to do a lot worse for that to happen. Oh, I have done plenty of things I'm not proud of, but one thing I've never done is keel over in front of my own son from shoving too much coke up my nose. Oh, well, congratulations. I'll get your frame certificate, it shall I? It must have been terrified, Ross! I mean, what if he'd ended up under a car? Or in the stream? I thought he would be fine with me, OK? He's always fine with me. It was the one decent thing I had in my life and I've let him down. So then why try and take him away when you know you're not up to it? I am. Just... can't do it. If I stick around here, I'll never be the dad that he deserves if I don't go. Well, you'll have to prize him out of my cold, dead hands first. Pointless anyway. Bex has changed her mind. Stuck here. I swear, I'm... Rebecca, know you're this upset? Uh, no. Well, she should. She's only just holding it together herself. Well, then go, the pair of you. It makes sense. Uh, but she wants to play nice with Aaron and Robert, doesn't she? Could be at least six months before we get a legal decision. Longer, probably. So then you leave the kids here and you both go and get your head straight. Uh, that'd work perfectly for you, wouldn't no. it? No. For Moses, so he's actually got a dad worth visiting. Bex won't leave without Seb. And she needs me here. And yet you'll be miserable here. Stuck it out for this long, haven't I? You, um. Won't stop me from seeing him, will you? Not if you drop the court stuff now. Okay. And I'm gonna be watching you like a hawk now. I'm not gonna mess up again. You're a good dad, Ross. And you will be an even better one away from here. It's such a 